Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Before we get started, have you subscribed to my YouTube channel yet? If not, be sure to click on the big red subscribe button on my main page. And once you have done this, don't forget to click on that bell to be the first to get notified when I upload a new video. In today's video, I will be showing you a couple of ways to stop Apex Legends from crashing and freezing. Fingers crossed these fixes will help fix your problem. To start off with, all you need to do is click on the link that's in the description below and you will end up on a page that looks like this. This is the easy anti-cheat system that Apex Legends uses. You now need to click on the two links that are here. It will now open up two pages. As you can see, it says OK connection and it also says OK connection on the other tab. That means I have an OK connection to the easy cheat network. The next thing to check is our graphics card drivers. If you are using NVIDIA, then you need to head on over to the NVIDIA website. If you're using AMD, head on over to the AMD website and download the latest graphics card drivers. Because if you're using out of date graphics card drivers, then you will encounter a lot of problems. If you are using NVIDIA, you can always update it using the NVIDIA GeForce experience if you do have that installed. By simply going down to the bottom right hand corner of your screen and right clicking on the icon and then pressing the GeForce experience button. As you can see, it has detected there's a few updates and it's starting to update them for me now. This is probably just for the GeForce experience, not the drivers, but I will find that out in a minute. The next test, once you have updated to the latest graphics card drivers, is to make sure you are running the latest Windows updates. To do this, all you need to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen and left click and you now need to type in update and you need to simply click on check for updates. And this will now check your system to see if you have the latest Windows update. And as you can see, it has detected a little update there for Windows Defender, which it's installing now. Once you have applied any Windows updates, make sure you restart your computer. This is the NVIDIA GeForce experience, as you can see. If I now go to Drivers tab over on the top left here, we do have a new driver that I need to install. And to do this, all you need to do is press download and just follow the instructions. And that's for NVIDIA. Once you have updated your graphics card drivers and also checked for any Windows updates and installed the latest updates, the next step is to try Apex Legends and see if it works. If it still doesn't work or it crashes, if you are using any antivirus programs or firewall on your computer, disable any security on your system. Once you've done that, try and boot up Apex Legends again and see if it was the security software that was making the game crash. I have had this issue with Apex Legends with antivirus making it not work and I've actually removed the antivirus program from my computer now and that was actually a fast antivirus which I do love a lot but I also do love my gaming a lot as well. Once you have tried that and if you are still unsuccessful then you now need to open up Origin and you need to right click on Apex Legends and simply click on repair. And it will now run a repair process on Apex Legends and just make sure all the files on the game are all okay and not corrupt. And if it does detect anything, then it will just install the new files. As you can see, it's running down in the bottom left hand corner here, which is all good. You can then try and launch Apex Legends and hopefully that will fix any problems you are having. But if that still does not fix your problems, then you now need to minimize Origin and you simply need to right click on the Apex Legends shortcut on your desktop if you have it. If you don't, just go to your start menu and find Apex Legends by simply going down to the bottom left, 
typing in Apex Legends and right clicking on Apex Legends and going on to Open File Location. You now need to right click on the shortcut and go to Properties and you now need to go across to Compatibility and we now want to simply click on the Run This Program as a Administrator and press Apply and OK and hopefully that will also help any problems you are having. Unfortunately, that does pretty much bring us to the end. If you're still having problems with Apex Legends, then you need to reinstall the game. I know you did not want to hear that, but unfortunately you have run out of options. And to do this, all you need to do is right click on the game, press uninstall, and then reinstall the game. And hopefully that will remove any issues you are having. I hope this tutorial has helped. If it has, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.